Developing right now the search for a suspect after a disturbing crime right in the middle of a local neighborhood. A pregnant woman killed and two other children shot after a gunman opens fire on their car. The youngest victim in this just 10 months old. This violent scene unfolded yesterday along Gamble Avenue and Dunsford Drive. That's east of Powers Drive in Pine Hills. Sashel Saunders is there live this morning. Sashel, the sheriff is calling on the community to help them get results and make an arrest. Uh, of course he is, uh, Kirsten. As you can imagine, deputies, they came over here and they saw a 13-year-old who was shot, who had run from the car and was begging for help. So they want the people who are responsible for this to be in jail as soon as possible. It was like pop, 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 pop. Shot after shot fired into a car filled with children. Deputies say the shooters wanted someone dead inside. It appeared that the suspect vehicle was pursuing the silver vehicle and targeted the vehicle for whatever reason. But who and why is still being investigated? A couple was inside, both 21 years old. The man wasn't hurt. The woman, Imelda Francois, was shot several times. She and her unborn baby died at the hospital. Her 10-month-old in the back seat hit by bullet fragments and a 13-year-old shot in the arm. I'm pregnant, you know, and then she's, she had a whole child and, you know, it's sad. Two other children, a six and 15 year old, were also inside but not hurt. Investigators are now questioning that boyfriend about what happened, but didn't have any suspect names yet. They say they're looking for two men in an older model white Malibu. A local pastor begged someone to come forward. Put yourself in the shoes of the family that a life has been taken and even a child that the mother was pregnant with and turn yourself in. And, you know, during the press conference yesterday, Sheriff Deming said this is not a neighborhood that they are typically called to. And so they're asking anyone who may have seen anything or who knows about what happened to either call Orange County deputies or to call Crime Line at 1-800-423-TIPS. Reporting live in Pine Hills, Sashel Saunders, News 6. All right.